What good is a rose to me, void of your scent? What good is spring to me, without your presence? What good is a day to me, where you do not dawn? What good is this world to me, when you have gone? I refuse the rain that has not brushed off your skin. I refuse that breeze. If the stars were to shine for you, then let them shine forth. But I refuse the stars that gleam in the heavens, if not for you. If the nightingales were to chirp, then let them do so in your tribute. And so I would not listen to any nightingale if it is not in your acclaim. If my longing is for you, then let my heart burn. I'd refuse my homeland if it were to be devoid of you. I'd refuse my nation. If a fire were to erupt in my heart, then let it be the fire of love in your veneration. And if my heart were to be incinerated down to rubble, with a fire of love that is not blazing in your name, I refuse this heart, I refuse this fire, I refuse this ember. The oasis in which I cannot see you, let the Bedouins keep. I'd still be content with your barren desert and I'd relinquish the water. If it were to lead to you, I would not stop on that path. I loathe the destination where you do not await. I detest that path. I am a willing slave with an earring pierced. If I was to conquer your heart, I would march past a thousand deserts like the Sinai. Otherwise, what is the point of all of this struggle? I'd refuse this conquest. I'd refuse Egypt. I'd refuse this earth. I, I Sultan I, Fatih, Fatih, standing here before Istanbul, would incinerate this city for a glimpse of your smile. Otherwise, I would refuse a rain and refuse Istanbul if it brought you no joy. I am an insignificant poet, yet all I write is you. I yearn for you. I refuse to write with the pen and paper that does not scribe your love. I am part of your ummah. You are my master. I refuse any master except you. I refuse any beloved except you. I refuse. I refuse. I refuse.